Hi, I'm Amanda, the Undercover Yarn Smob, and today I'm going to show you what I got in my Summer Happy Mail um, in the Llama Mama Kayla Summer Happy Yarn Mail Swap, all that good stuff. <laughs> so my partner was Amy, and she's in Alabama, and um, I'm really pleased with what I got. Um, first, she sent a couple of pattern books. She knows I like the Amigurumi, so it's like really cute patterns. We'll definitely be making these. And the other pattern I just really love, um, it's 26donuts at gmail.com or jnowal at um, Ravelry, but it's, um, it's a little messy crochet pattern. Isn't that cute? I'll definitely be making this little cutie. And um, she got me some little treats. The Hershey's Gold Kisses. Um, I really like the Hershey's Gold, but I've never seen the kisses like this. That's me. And um, she also sent a little bag of the Hazelnut Spread M&Ms. They were so good. Um, they didn't even make it past the rest of the unboxing. Um, I got a few crochet hooks. They're a 4.25 up to a 5.25. So always a good thing to have. Oh, she sent me this cute, I'm a coffee lover, so this cute little clipboardy. Like a picture stand on the back. So that's really cute. Oh, and I just love this. Um, I guess it's a little keychain or like a bag accessory, but um, yeah, it's really pretty. The Lotus Blossom. And the eye, I'm not sure what that's called, but this is just beautiful though. I love it. Really pretty. And now the yarn. Alright, the first one is the Red Heart Super Saver Stripes. This is Flamenco Stripe. Really pretty. Of course, the purple. Lots and lots of purple. And next, um, I absolutely love these, but I just never, never bought one for myself. So here is the Mandala Sparkle. It's in the color Draco. It's a really pretty minty green, purple, pink, blue, and of course sparkles. Really very pretty. Didn't even know what I'm going to make with it. And next I got a mandala. And this is in the troll colorway. And of course the dark blue, the purple, the pink, and this mint green. It looks really nice together. And next I got a skein of the Isaac Mizrahi. This is um, really pretty. I actually have one of those big designer bags from AC Moore full of these. So this one definitely get used to make something even bigger. Um, it's called Spanish Harlem. And those little loops are like a purple and a light blue. It is really pretty. It's really thick too though. It's like a bulky. But yeah, like I said, I already have about six of those. So that is going to help make something very nice. And she got me a Ferris wheel. It is the cotton candy color. Pretty, pretty purple, blue, green. That's my wheelhouse right there. It's very pretty and so soft, really soft. I can't wait to see um, what I can make with this. Probably a little scarf. I was thinking maybe the um, Chevron lace would look really pretty in that. And last. I was so excited about this. Um, I know you can't find this anywhere anymore. It's the Red Heart Boutique Sachet. And this colorway is called Boogie. 
that's appropriate, but it's a sparkly purple tones. And um, I've been really wanting to make some of these. I see them around on clearance and everything, but never the purple one. But um, I want to try making, or I want to make a chain scarf. You just take this whole strand and you just make a bunch of chains and then wrap it all around. Makes a cute little um, cowl. So that's what I'm going to do with that. And I'm excited I got the purple one. Alright, next we have some Dove Beauty Cream. This cute little can, tin, container. But that should help, help a lot. And then, um, she sent me some coffees. This is Indulgio, actually that's hot chocolate. Should be really yummy. Uh, some French roast. Well, two French roasts. <laughs> And this cute coffee cup cozy. Look, it's purple, like a purple tweed. Multicolored tweeds, I guess. That is so cute. Let's see the button. It's a really cute button, too. But inside the, um, well, the mug <laughs> is really cute, too. I don't know why I would cover that up. This is a donut care. So I have to find a plain mug to put this on so everybody can see that I do not care. And the last thing we got was this really neat bag. Green and gold. And it says love. So that's a nice little project bag. Stash bag. <laughs> right. So yeah, um, I had a really great time with the... Um, Happy Mail Swap, and I will definitely be doing it again. I know I, I know for sure I'm going to join the October halloween -y one, because that's my favorite holiday ever, and I'm going to go crazy on that one, I'm sure. So, yeah, and um, if you stay tuned, I have a little clip. Um, my swap partner doesn't have, um, doesn't do YouTube or anything. Um, I don't even think she's posted anything in the Facebook page, but, um, I'm going to add a little video I took before I sent Amy her package of what I put in her package. So if you want to see that, hang on just one moment. And I will see you guys next time. Hi. <laughs> I'm back again. Um, hopefully you enjoyed my the unboxing from my swap partner, Amy, in the Mama Mama Yarn Swap. Um, like I said in one of my earlier videos, she doesn't have a YouTube video uh, channel. So I figured I would come on and show you as well what I got her and sent to her. Um, she is in Alabama. And she loom knits. And um, she prefers like the chunkier yarns. So, because um, I think she said she has arthritis or something in the smaller yarn. It doesn't work so well for her. She will use worsted, but that's about as low as she'll go. So I went ahead and got her some chunky yarns. Um, she expressed some interest in the t-shirt yarn, but, uh, I checked my Dollar Trees. They didn't have any in, anywhere in sight. Um, so I went ahead and went on Yarn Inspirations and got her a couple of skeins of the Burnett Maker Home Decor. This is Pacific Varg. And I got her the complimenting color in Aqua. And this is a bulky five and a 72% cotton, 28% nylon. Uh, I think it's the outside covering is nylon and then there's cotton inside of it. I think is what they were saying on the website of how it's made. So. I got her those two. And um, while I was at AC Moore looking for this yarn swap, I found the Premier Serenity Big Ombre. And this is a bulky five. It is 
273 yards. And this one is Malibu. It's a nice turquoise ombre. And it's looking a little bit darker, I think, than right here in real life. But, yeah, I thought that was really neat. I'd never seen this before. And it's really soft. Super soft. And look how the ombre is. It kind of speckles a little bit. I think I'm going to go ahead and go um, wait for another 60% off coupon and get a, another one of these for her, too before I send it off. It's really neat. And being that she's in Alabama, I don't believe she has an AC more. So I figured I would get her some AC more yarn. And this is Stitch Studio by Nicole called Comfort. It's a bulky five. And this one is 326 yards. I don't think it has a colorway. It just says FPA and a bunch of numbers. So yeah, but it's like a little tweedy speckle or fleck yarn. It's like a, a turquoise base and it's got all the purple, reds, green flecks in it. So I thought that was nice and summery looking. And pretty good sized ball of yarn. Okay, and then um, as I showed you in an earlier Yarn Speaks, I'm sending her Rita, <laughs> the beach bear. It's turned out really cute. <clears throat> I don't know how I'm going to let go of her, but that's what I made her for. So she's going with it. Um, and since she was a loom knitter, um, I think she told me she only had a few looms, like a couple of large ones and a medium one. So I'm hoping um, she'll be able to use this, but I found her a cute, well, a flower loom. <laughs> so I'm hoping she can use that and it's not too difficult for her on her hands. And then she can make some really cute flowers. And let's see. She's also really into the fairy gardens, which um, I'm a huge fan too. I just, I don't have a green thumb, but I would love, love to have a fairy garden. I might just go out and put one around one of my trees or something. They're so cute. But um, I found this cute little swing. I'm going to send her that. I don't know how I'm going to package it up, but find a little box for it, I guess. And it's like a little leaf, a little leaf swing. So cute. And the other thing I got for her fairy garden is a little llama. They, uh, they actually call it a llama, but I think it's an alpaca. It's got the little short ears. So I'm going to say it's an alpaca. Uh, I also figured that a couple of little craft packs would be cute. There's a little llama magnet pack. And you just glue all the little decorations onto it. It's really cute. And um, I have I have one diamond painting that is almost done. And I really did, I really enjoy it. I, don't, I just haven't pulled it back out yet to finish it up. Um, but I will. I need to soon. But I figured I would give... Um, give her a set of these little stickers. You can make the little butterfly and flowers and um, it comes with everything and they're stickers. I just thought that was so cute. And they have a bunch of different ones so I might be getting some more of these little guys for myself. <laughs> and I got her this little cup is life's a beach enjoy the waves it's really tall too it's a tall one um, and like I said it's a summer swap so everything was pretty summery and I found this little can koozie it says hello summer and the little lemons on it 
and this little notions pouch with ice cream that says sweet. <laughs> I just thought that was so cute. And this main one, I don't know if I should take it out or not. Oh, I already opened it. So why not? <laughs> but this is one of the things I got at Hershner's. Um, I saw this when I was shopping for some unique different yarns for the swap, which I decided to keep. <laughs> but I'm gonna send the bag that I bought for and it's a nice drawstring. And it says high in fiber and <laughs> low in calories. I just thought that was a really cool bag. I'm tempted to keep this one too, but I'm not going to keep it. I have enough bags. So, yeah. That is everything that I sent to my partner in the Llama Mama yarn swap for summer. Summer Happy Mail. Thanks for watching. Bye. Hi, just wanted to add one more thing here. These are a couple of stitch markers that I made for the summer Happy Mail yarn swap for my swap partner, Amy. And um, these are actually uh, the light bulb stitch markers, which um, I really fell in love with when Z sent me a pack of those. Um, they were like brightly colored ones, and I really love the light bulb stitch markers. I don't know officially what they're called, but yeah. So those are little summery stitch markers for my swap partner.